Hi, this is your Phoenix. Back to do another energy update for the sign of Taurus. Just keep in mind these are general readings. They're not going to resonate for all of you. But for the ones that it does resonate for, please like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. For those of you interested in a personal reading with me, all the information will be in the description box below. This is going to be for the Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs of Taurus. So let's jump into this reading and see what is coming through for you guys this week. Alright, so you're focused on work. You're putting your energy into work. You're doing a lot of working right now. But there seems to be some type of worry and anxiety running in the back of your mind. You received some type of communication that was concerning to you. So although you're at work, your head is not there. Because you're focused on a particular person. Someone that you find to be very mysterious, very elegant, very sexy. You're waiting for communication from this person. You're waiting for this person to say something to you. Because there may be no communication between you and this person at this point in time. And you're waiting for, for this person to communicate with you. So all you can think about is this person and them messaging you or them calling you. Yeah, because you haven't spoken to them in a bit and they never give you clarity as to why they stop speaking to you. So it's kind of a puzzling situation for you. You want to reconcile with this individual. You want this relationship to come back online. So that is what is running in the back of your mind. Now you may be working and trying to put your focus there. But in the back of your mind, you're still thinking about reconciling with this person. Because I guess they are the ones that uh, not really abandon you, but stop communicating with you. And that left a kind of void in your life. Because you probably spoke to this person every single day. You're waiting for a message concerning a love offer, but it doesn't seem to be coming forth for you as of this time. So you're wondering why is that not happening for you? Yeah, because you feel stuck in a situation. You could be dealing with a cancer or Libra, sorry. Yeah, but you feel stuck because you can't move on from this person. All you think of is this person. All you want to do is be with this person. You've tried to walk away, but it would seem that it's not happening for you. I think you both have been trying to pull away from each other, but it's just not happening. It's like the more you pull away from this person, is the more you want this person. But you can't seem to achieve the type of relationship that you want with them so you carry it around with you like an armor constantly thinking about it obsessing about it wondering what this person is doing because you want that offer of love to come your way could be a scorpio pisces or cancer you're dealing with 
but you want this person to make this offer of a relationship to you because you've been waiting on them to say something now you may be guarded against them but you're still having hope that they will come back to you you have a decision that you have to make as regards the action that you need to take and which part you're choosing to take it because you want a new beginning and passion with this person you want all this craziness to end and for you guys to get back into a relationship and be the loving couple that you were before but it would seem that is only silence you're getting from this person this person may be having an awakening at this point in time it could be a Virgo you're dealing with but this person is in deep contemplation as to what to do with their own life and with their own circumstances but you on the other hand know that this person is your only option this is the only person you want to be with but still no communication is happening and no matter what you do no matter what you try no matter how you try to speak to them they are not reciprocating your advances at all and this is causing you some deep frustration because you feel like you're down on your luck things are not working out for you so emotionally you're a wreck because you want to be with this person you want to be in a relationship with them you want to spend time with them you want to talk to them but for some reason they've gone completely silent on you and you feel like you're down on your luck you're feeling hopeless you're feeling like things aren't working out for you in this situation but you're trying to keep up your energy you're trying to be the very best that you can be physically you're trying to stay in high vibration because you know you can take care of yourself it could be a libra or taurus you're dealing with or you could have it in your chart but you are trying to keep your wits about you, not show anyone that you're crashing on the inside. But all you want is this person to see you, this person to recognize you, this person to want you. Because you are stuck on them like nobody else. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn you're dealing with, or you could have this in your chart but you see this person as your significant other you are ready to pack up your dating gears and be committed to this person yeah you want commitment with them you want loyalty you want happy home you want a sense of security where this person is concerned it may be a past life connection why you feel this strong pull to this person or it could be that you have both you both made a lot of fun wonderful memories along the way and this makes you feel nostalgic from time to time but it breaks your heart that they are not speaking to you or communicating with you or making this distance between the both of you it hurts that they act like they don't care they act like being with you is a problem or that communicating with you takes so much out of them it hurts but there is something that you're going to realize or something that is going to be shown to you very soon Right now, you feel like there's no growth potential in the relationship. You might come to realize that there is a lot of growth potential in the relationship. Could be a cancer you're dealing with. But this person is about to express how they truly feel for you. I think they were trying to sort through how they really felt and what it is they really wanted and how to go about getting it. You're trying not to regret the past. You're trying not to regret loving this person. You try not to focus too much on what is not happening, but rather than what you want to happen. Because right now, this relationship isn't working out at all for you. 
you don't feel the love from this person that you feel for this person. But it would seem that there is a new beginning coming. A cycle has closed off and a new one has begun. Stop stressing about it because you have a lot of sleepless nights worrying about if this person will return to you. Yes, they will. Things will work out. So the relationship may not be a relationship right now. But there is something that you don't know. There is something that you aren't seeing. Mm -hmm. This person is at a stalemate. They are not sure what actions to take when it comes to you. They're in their ego. They're in their ego. They're being controlling and manipulative because that is the onus how they can deal with their own emotions. They're trying to control themselves. They're trying to control their feelings. They're trying to control how things play out for them. They are confused by their own emotions for you. Because it feels so strong that they are hiding from them, from their own selves. Could be a Scorpio, Pisces or Cancer or Aries, Leo, Sag. But this person is afraid about how they feel, yes. They want everything with you. You make them happy in a way that they never felt it. They are in love with you more than they can express it. And that is the reason why they need time to figure themselves out, balance themselves out. Because they feel crazy when they're with you. It's just too much for this person to handle at this point in time. All right, let me see what is the most likely outcome for the situation. Okay, so eventually they will have that conversation with you. They will actually start to communicate again. But don't expect too much from it. Because they can go silent again. Once they keep having this internal battle within them. It is <clears throat> a lot for them to carry. <clears throat> and there are a lot of things that they have to overcome. They are learning very harsh lessons right now concerning love the growth potential, the personal enlightenment. So this person could actually be going through a spiritual awakening. But luck is on your side. Things will move in your favor. And they will actually start to communicate with you again. But like I said, do not put too much into the communication because this person is still a work in progress. All right? So they may get scared about how they feel again and run. Okay, so this is what I have for you guys. I hope it does help. Have a good one.